In this tutorial, I want to teach you how to animate this fake 3D hunting camera. So stay with me until the end of the video. To start, I create a full HD composition. Now we need to draw the components of the camera, which we can use the ellipse tool. I remove its stroke and draw a circle for the eye part of the camera. If you hold shift, a full circle will be drawn. Right click on it and select center anchor point from the transform section so that its anchor point is exactly in the middle of the circle. Press F2 so that no layer is selected. Select the ellipse tool and this time activate the stroke for it. Set its size to for example 50 and draw a circle like this. If you hold shift a full circle will be drawn. For this circle I also select the center anchor point from the transform section. We now have two layers which we are the beginning and the end of the camera. Place this circle anywhere you like to determine the length of the camera. Now I create a solid. Name it whatever you like, it doesn't matter. I search for the beam effect from the effects and preset panel and place it on this layer. A line is created here. You need to make a series of settings. First, I set the length to 100. I also change these two colors to white. Hold Alt and click on the starting point to open the expression section. Select these two layers and activate the position by pressing P. Now we have to connect this starting point to the position of the first layer in this way. When you press enter on the numpad, you will see that this line is placed in the middle of the circle. Click on this layer and hold alt and click on the ending point and in this way connect the ending point to the position of the second layer. If you press enter on the numpad, that side of the line will also be placed in the middle of the second circle and in this way this line is connected to two circles. Now I will move this layer above the line so that it is placed on the line. Select this line layer and increase the starting thickness. I also set this softness to zero. For example, I increase the starting thickness up to here. You can also slightly increase the ending thickness so that the end of it has a beautiful effect. Now I will make a duplicate of this layer with Ctrl D. We can change its color to this color. Like this. Set the length to 0 and reduce the time and place a circle in the middle. Here for example. I duplicate this layer again and change this color to white. And then I reduce the starting thickness. In this way, a pipe-like shape is created in the middle. Our work is finished. Now if I move this circle, you can see that this hunting camera moves in any direction we move and we created a fake 3D mode. Also if we move this circle, the hunting camera will move and we can easily animate the position of these two circles. I create a keyframe for position of the both layers. Suppose we want to animate this camera in 20 frames. In this frame, I will place this circle here. And I will place this second circle below. You can see that we can beautifully animate this camera in any direction we want. For example, in this frame, I put this circle here. 
and I move this circle from the X and Y axis and place it here for example or put it here so you can animate this camera in any way you want I hope you enjoyed this video if you like it please subscribe to our channel thanks for watching